What's up, everybody? It's your boy Kid Smooth from the official Wii Game Here.com. Just wanted to update you on the Xbox Accessories app, aka the button mapping app, which allows you to change your button on your Xbox One controller, whether it's an elite controller or a standard Xbox One controller. It is available to you now, or it at least is available to you if you're in the new uh dashboard with the new patch it was original it was on the original um dashboard update um but you couldn't really use it it was just there as a placeholder um now you can go in and actually configure stuff and mess with it and change your buttons around now personally i'll tell you guys i'm not really into like changing the buttons and whatnot i don't think i'm going to use it but it is cool that the option is there for you now here you go you have the button mapping option down you'll see the uh how you how you can swap the sticks how you can invert the the y axis and the y stick axis and and swap the triggers and whatnot we can click on button um the button map and then we can uh change what we want to do like i can change the a button to the r trigger so if we if i wanted to run in gears of war instead of using the a button i could turn it to the r button <laughs> but it'll also change a couple of things with a so um it's really kind of set up universally. It doesn't, I guess, from the game to game, you might want to have to alter this or you're going to have to set up a uh, reset like your game controls inside the game option. I'm not too sure on how it will work from game to game. But me personally, like I said, I won't use it, but it is here and available for those who were curious. Um, I honestly thought it was coming later, but it's here now. And if you have the, um, the dashboard update and the patch that just came out last night um, of course when you get the elite controller it will come with this app so um, either way you'll have uh, access to it and then it will be obviously available for all once this new dashboard is complete um, I I don't the thing is I don't think you need the new dashboard to have this app if I'm not mistaken because when the elite controller comes out technically this the dashboard won't be available unless you're in a preview program so i don't know if it's available on the old app somebody might will have to correct me because i don't have the old dashboard anymore so um you guys let me know but let me know what you think of this uh video will you be using this feature uh make sure you hit the like subscribe and let me know in the comments otherwise i'll see you guys later xbox is the best box and i am the best